right. Hey, hey, hey. It's April Ray. That rhymed. Uh, I don't know why. I, yeah. <laughs> All right, hello and welcome. This is April Ray, the introvert mogul with theintrovertmogul.com. Thank you for joining me. So I want to talk to you again, like my normal videos have been about recently, is about branding. I can't stress the importance of branding enough. However, what I'm seeing people doing is not branding. Okay, let me let me backtrack my story. When I first got online, I discovered, you know, I was thinking about network marketing. I had a business that I was in and I quickly discovered that you should be branding you and not your MLM business. Why? Because you never know what's going to happen with that business. Two, because people don't care about your business. And three, because it just makes you look like a door-to-door -door salesman online, right? And I was like, that's genius. That makes so much sense to me. I, I get it. I get it. So what do they tell you to do? Get your website up, um, get your logo, make sure you have your colors that you like and put, slap your picture uh, on your banner. I did all those things, right? And, uh, and it actually worked. For a lot of people, it worked like gangbusters, right? They're, they're attracting more people, they have a bigger audience. It really, really does work. But now the problem is, is that having a logo and having cool fonts and having cool colors having a website none of that is branding okay this is actually what we call your brand identity it actually those things identify your brand so if your brand isn't your logo and it's not your picture with your banner with your cool tagline then what is branding well um, I'm not going to tell you on this video. I'm actually going to tell you on the, on the next video just to keep you in suspense. <laughs> so let me go on to say because of the fact that people were taught just the, the, the surface level of branding, actually the end part of branding, that's like the cart before the horse kind of branding, there's like a sea of websites that have been abandoned in cyberspace. There's all kinds, and I hear it all the time with my clients. Well, I had a website and I was blogging and then I just got bored with it and I just stopped doing it. I don't know, I should start doing it again and blah, 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 blah. And right there I knew that even though they had their own blog and, and, and it had their own picture and everything like that and it wasn't really necessary talking about their network marketing business, they didn't brand because I'll give you the one secret tip. Branding creates an emotional con connection not only with your brand yourself it connects you and your brand but it connects your audience and your brand your ideal customer and your brand so in the next video which I want you to make sure that you look at when I get it I'm gonna give it to you I'm gonna let you know what branding really is and how you can make it fun for your business all right, so make sure if you got any value from this, make sure to leave a comment. And if you are on my YouTube channel, please subscribe to iMogul TV. If you're on Facebook, um, tell me if you got value or if it sucked. All right, so I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye for now.